Hey guys, um, Feather Top here. Um, don't worry about the quality. I'm using my old camera because my new camera is charging and I can't be stopped waiting for it. Um, a couple of this is back in the um, Ascension gameplay video. There's only just so you guys know, there's only really two of them out there, but there's so many duplicates it doesn't really matter. Um, I just want to go over a couple of things here. Um, this part first with the Gersh device. I just want to play the video. Which uh, is uh, that's just a black hole mark. Yeah. See, see if you can see the guy Tan Ops uh, is jumping. He's about to jump into the black, the singularity. I'm not sure whether that will kill him or that will transport him to another part of the map. Just watch. Keep your eyes on the top right hand corner. No screamer. Jeez, get over it. Um, and you throw it. Yep. See, he went straight in, and, and he up, disappears. Right? He's not there anymore. All right. Jeez, I sound weird on my old camera. <laughs> and before I get to the next part, I just want to clear up I'm Australian, not British, so drop that, all you trolls out there. Okay. Around the map. It's a great way, again, if, you're, if you need a panic, do a panic. He's using the sickle there. Retreat, everybody loads up on this lander. You'll take off, you'll fly through the air, you'll land back down inside of, uh, uh, inside of the, uh, the centrifuge. And, uh, and, and again, it's just a, it's another really unique way to move around the map. And... And, um, and, you know, everything about zombies, there's always something else, there's always a little secret to be found, so maybe... The See, uh, did you guys hear that? Something about a little secret to be found while using these landers. I'm not sure whether that means the um, new um, trophies or achievements that they have to go through all three landers, but I'm sure come March 1 I would have figured that out. Um, and also, if you see over here, it looks like a girl's face, I'm not sure what that means. But, um, yeah, that's <laughs> a bit weird. It's either a girl's face or it's just a something that we're all getting wrong. And Anyway, just to get back onto the um, main topic here, um, it seems as if there is a lot more stuff to be found in Ascension, but it doesn't seem like they're closing it up here. This looks like just another map pack. This doesn't look like it's closing anything off. And I think that puts a good stride in for a map pack too, before we hopefully get a video explaining everything. How small are those stupid space monkeys? What do you guys reckon? They're tiny, and they're obviously really, really weak, but they are really annoying, from what it seems. But if you ha don't have any perks, I wonder what they do. If they come, do they only come when you get your first perks? Or do, they, or do they wait for you, or do they come straight away? They, don't, they seem like they're doing damage, but oh, this guy doesn't have any perks, so it's still gone for him. I uh, have them replaced, in a sense. See, now he has the um, new perk, I'm pretty sure that's PhD flopper. With space monkeys. You can and see it flashing. I think if you get this, oh, oh, I see it again, I'm sorry guys. Um, <coughs> try that again. Um, you think if you get the perks, um, if you have that perk, the space monkey is going to go for that perk machine. And if it destroys that perk machine, you lose that perk. Or if it's on it for a certain amount of time, you lose the perk. Um, it doesn't destroy the perk machines, but it destroys the perk that you have by going on the perk machines. And I, I don't know. That's just what I'm thinking. Because if you look here... Um, look, it's his thing is flashing because they're on that perk machine. And then it stops flashing. But they definitely look really weak. And they drop a max ammo. So, uh, what, see, look, his quick revive is flashing. I don't know what that means. Of course, there's so much more. Sorry, that's me. Show you guys. Of course, there's. So much more. <laughs> Didn't I stuff that up? See, if it was my new camera, I would have paused it until I got it right. But you guys have to wait through this. There we go. So you can see that's a good look at the ghost device. Um, just a sec. I'm thirsty. Leave me alone. Um, it looks like it has like. I'm not sure what they, what they are, maybe that's how it balances or something. It's definitely, it's like a big blue disc. I'll bring the camera closer. 
See, this makes a lot of noise, I don't know, when I pick the camera up, this old camera. Yeah, it seems like it's got a switch on it, that's probably how you turn it on. Um, it's probably the best look at the ghost device we're going to get so far. And yeah, I'm just looking at another guy's YouTube video, and just another little thing. This guy has claymores, which means claymores are back in this, and not bouncing beddies like me and a couple of my guys wanted. Okay, next we have... Let's keep rolling it. Will we say Thunder Gun? First, it's just funny how little, how few people know about the zombie story, and that's really the only reason why the zombies are still going, <laughs> besides the massive popularity. But <laughs> it's just funny how over 50% of the people who play zombies have no idea about it, and half of the stuff that he said in this in this um, trailer here would be making no sense to them. Uh, noobs. I hate saying that word. On the subject of Black Ops for our community highlight, our resident Call of Duty expert Roger Dodger went in search of some amazing community footage, and he found this delight. Remember, everyone, if you have feedback, anything. But it is a stamina up machine. Um, it sucks that Xbox get it first, and um, PlayStation and PC have to wait. It's probably because Bill Gates paid a lot more money. As you can see here, I'm not sure where you can read that. I'll pick it up again and brace your ears. It says it's worth 2,000 points. Um, I honestly think it should be a little bit less than that if it's only going to be like marathon. But who am I to, who am I to judge? And another little thing I put in my last video, how that looks like um, over here, looks like an AK. I'm pretty sure that's just an RPK or something like that. So, sorry about getting your hoops up. Hello. God, this is annoying. Who uses the law? Another thing that I've noticed with these zombies, they seem to be all going for certain players. They don't just go for the closest player. Because, as you can see, unless there's a guy, there is probably a guy over there, but some of them would normally go to him, some of them would normally come here, but each one seems to have designated players like Hellhounds now. Which is pretty weird. Ghost device, again. Get them all getting sucked in. And, ah, oh, there, ah. Oh, that was a good look at it. Just watch Baby Blue Ops and the other dude just jump in. They, they jump in. And they disappear. And that's all for now. Good.